in the press uh, as an advocacy of war. You do not advocate World War III seriously, do you? Uh, no, so I, that's, that's mean that uh, I uh, told to the press that one day the World War, the Third World War will come. But I do not know when and where. And contrary, if uh, he put the question that there is uh, the World World War inevitable or not, if I reply there will be no the Third World War, that is not correct. Because in the world, always there were the war, and there were the two world wars. There are many wars. Even now, there are the war too, uh, <coughs> big or small scale. <coughs> But in the world, never there is war. There is no war. That's my theory. I, I reply. Could you kindly give us your appraisal of the Bandung Conference? Bandung Conference. Um, and now I, I feel and receive so many news and reports from my countries and by the many sources that Bandung Conference gives many good results to the United Nations on the to the uh, this means uh, they worked under the framework of the charter of the United Nations and therefore my country we appreciate the outcome of the reason of the bundle. Minister, uh, do you think we ought to work for a ceasefire uh, in the Formosa Straits, and, and how should it be done? A uh, ceasefire in the <coughs> Taiwan Strait, <coughs> and now is uh, the negotiation is going on, perhaps uh, in uh, the great power. To, to satisfy that, if the, the United Nations can ask the Chinese uh, communists to ceasefire first, and perhaps uh, the, the, the ceasefire in that area will be fulfilled. It's not our side of free will at all. <coughs> Depend on the communist uh, Chinese. Please. Uh, sir. Uh, the reports you received from Bandung uh, yes. indicate that Chu Enlai has lost some of his well, uh, popularity with the other Eastern nations, the Asiatic nations, or some of his influence. I, I, I don't uh, confirm the, uh, that, uh, but, but uh, we, we received uh, only short report from my Prince Wan that uh, the Bandung <coughs> conference uh, was uh, going on under the frameworks of the United Nations. And therefore, the outcome <coughs> or the reason of that Bandung conference is a uh, very good, uh, uh, brings uh, brought uh, back uh, with a good results from the Bandung conference, from the free, free world. <coughs> Mr. Prime Minister, uh, last year, uh, Thailand wanted a peace observation commission sent down there to observe the situation. Yes. Do you still want such a commission sent, and will you make any move to request it? Yes, and uh, now the <coughs> that uh, request uh, is uh, still uh, uh, pending to the uh, security council. Uh, I asked my my advisor. <laughs> And uh, now we have the, the new organizations, that means uh, Seattle, you see. Uh, therefore, my government will not, uh, uh, will not um, in, in, insist, insist for the observation uh, more. Mm -hmm. Insist, insist. Huh? Yes. Could you tell us some uh, words about Indochina? How do you <coughs> feel about it? As a in Indochina, Indo uh, perhaps uh, for you, you know very well after the Geneva Conference, 
But uh, the new incidence uh, uh, has uh, grown in South Vietnam. The situation there is very, very con confusing. Perhaps uh, we wait for uh, for uh, one or two weeks we can know the situation very well, better, and we can judge better too. But uh, if the South Vietnam <coughs> or in the Vietnam uh, <coughs> situations uh, seem like that, in my my country we uh, we. We don't afraid, you see, we, we, we can uh, keep peace and order in my country. Mr. Prime Minister, I don't want to trespass on your time, but I'd like to ask you, uh, the Please. general feeling is that in Europe things are getting better and that peace seems to be breaking out all over. Uh, do you think that the atmosphere and uh, the general international situation is improving in South Asia, in your area? Yes, so the situation is uh, everywhere, you see, improving. That's how I feel, but the many factors to, uh, to suffer. In Europe, in Southeast Asia, everywhere, I think the improving. The better to the, I have seen the free world, the better to the free world. And for the world, the whole world too. Thank you very much, excellent. Thank you. Hi, thank you, you very much. It has the occasion to President of our press association, Mr.